watching now or later and welcome to Hillian as well with me Hillian along with Mikir Holy Scared by the audio of the game again. <laughs> I forgot I raised the volume during when we watched a series together. <sighs> so yeah, I got ear blasted. <laughs> Uh, well, that, that is that wouldn't be the first way in which this game has been a bit painful. Like this annoying uh, music. Yeah, yeah and it, it, it's not I think bad. It was also, I think it was also to, of course, while I was cleaning my glasses as well. <laughs> At least I didn't uh, drop them. Uh, let's see. Yeah, last time we managed... Well, last time we... <laughs> Uh, we and Guybrush both did a big screw up as because the bank got robbed. We and Guy got uh, Guybrush got stuck inside of it. Uh, we managed to get out. Uh, then we accidentally exited the game without saving, so we had to do that again. And yeah, now Guybrush has to prove his innocence, uh, despite the guy who robbed the bank hardly looking like him, obviously wearing a mask, and well, sounding completely different. But yeah, it's Monkey Island. Of course, people are stupid and half deaf. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Nobody can do mental math anymore. No way. Real pirates don't need to add. Instead, we hire our pirate brethren, the accountants, to add and keep track of our treasure for us. What? <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. Ugh. It's full of names and numbers and lots and lots of math. Now, is there... there should be a reason why we broke into here. I believe this would qualify as a luscious fern. Um, there's something here? It's an empty scupperware container. Well, if it's... <laughs> it's with something and it ha Something can be stuck in it, we're going to steal it. Okay. Scupperware, I... I Oh no. <laughs> yeah, Tupperware, scupper, because uh, I guess to scupper something is a term. <laughs> My mind would go well, to, to scuttle. I think it's a, a very old joke that many may not get today. I shouldn't, you don't get it. <laughs> I mean, one of those very securely sealed packages that they were trying to sell that if you put a sandwich in it, it will stay fresh for a week or two. Or years, according to some. Yeah, that I do know, but I, I, I thought you meant something else. But yeah, Tupperware used to be... Yeah, it still sold pretty plenty well, I think. But now there's just so many copies and such that, well, <laughs> Tupperware itself is kind of in the background. Pirate Magazine. Popular news of the Caribbean's most scandalous and nefarious pirates. And in this month's issue, how to loot and pillage and still be there for the kids. Uh, I don't have time to read. So basically, how to become a pirate clown? I can't go out that way. Inspector Kennard is watching the entrance. Pirate cl Hellion! Really? <laughs> what? A pirate clown? I think they were referring to pirate parents. <laughs> oh yeah, that also works. <laughs> uh, some, sometimes I'm as dense as Guybrush and Apparently, Guybrush is dense enough to fall straight through the freaking floor. <laughs> uh, oh, this game. Oh, this friend of mine. Uh, are you going to move, Guybrush? Or are you stuck loading again? Ugh. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Yeah, I did see something about that scupperware on the... Well, yeah, they call it a hint book, but it's a straight-up walkthrough. Do this, do this, do this. So, yeah, I already knew that we had to get that. I don't think there's anything else we can get here, though. But let me double-check. Uh, pick up the scupperware, climb back up the ladder. And... Strange shadow on the wall. Oh, there. Okay, on the left, behind... Next to the lanterns, oh, oh, and we're oh, back nose. again. Oh, and uh, <laughs> no, Guybrush uh, is getting a weird shadow. It's a light fixture. Yep, 
Divers needs a moment to collect his thoughts. What's hey. that shadow? <laughs> of course, it takes him like half a minute to think of something like that. It looks like a nose. All it. Maybe I should edit in uh, like gear uh, gear uh, grinding noises during bits like this if <laughs> on the the vaults hey, that go up to use yeah, that go up to uh, YouTube. I'll bet this belongs to that smelly pirate guy. The one with no nose. I'll take that, Mr. Threepwood. Ah, what are you doing in here? I might ask you the same question. Instead, I'll just take that as evidence. Let's go try it on Peg Nose. What a great idea. Except no one knows where he is. Bring him in, and I'll consider it. But remember this. Even if it fits, it only proves he was in the bank. It doesn't tie him to the loot. You still think I did it, don't you? Yes, but I can be swayed by the right evidence. Now get out of here. All right. It's helpful. You're better and than also, uh, most would have been. Yeah, but still. Ew! Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh... Is it, that should trigger something uh, on the stream, uh, or did I not set that up? I thought I set it up. Uh, okay, did it, no. <laughs> uh, there was no notification of that by the night by the bot, but there should it have been. So uh, yeah, <laughs> thank you. For, oh, uh, sorry about that. I I thought I turned that off with. Uh, was. Uh, yeah, I sh I really should turn that freaking. Uh, chatbot off, but uh, thank you for the raids. Uh, well, yeah, eleven raiders from Kara Jitsu have joined, and yeah, they, they immediately got put into timeout for using too many, <laughs> too much capitalization. Sorry about that. <laughs> oh, bloody uh, heck! <laughs> uh, hello and welcome. Uh, <laughs> well, that serves as a good enough rec uh, reminder to turn that stupid thing off with that. But I really thought I'd I'd done that already. So please give me a moment. Uh, express caps disable. Uh, there we go. Now you can shout to your heart's content. <laughs> uh, uh, give me a second as well, so I can show a good side of this bot. Uh, S O. Kara, <laughs> let's see. It's, it's still timed out. To the, sorry, I, I thought I said what? Uh, <laughs> or oh, it's going up now. It's setting off <laughs> emote spam. Okay, bring that back up again. <laughs> uh, access emotes disable. And access symbols. There we go. Now only the uh, bad uh, the bad word list is up. <laughs> uh, let me make it up to you for with a shout out. See if that works. Let's see. Jitsu. Yep. There we go. Uh, thank you for the raids. <laughs> thank you for visiting. Uh, yeah, we're playing uh, one of the old Escape from Monkey Island games. And uh, uh, brush. There. There we go. And yeah, as you can see by its graphics, it is old, but it's also rather old in that it's, it doesn't really want to work all the time. Uh, which we'll probably see when Guybrush tries to jump out of the window to get out of this place. Uh, let's see, some people in the chat. Da, 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 da. The Toxic Priest, hello, <laughs> at the <laughs> at Kara getting... <laughs> <laughs> the timeout. Luck lucky I only have it set for like five uh, seconds. Uh, how's the stream going? Uh, pretty well. We only just started like 10 minutes ago. And it looks like we're going to be here for a few more minutes as Guybrush contemplates just getting out of this place because he refuses to use the front door. Uh, da -da, rip. Uh, da -da. So, yes. Sorry about that. <laughs> Hopefully things will go better with... Yep. I say that and immediately Kyvers jumps to his death. <laughs> and he just <laughs> Yeah, this this game is a bit broken. 
<laughs> yeah, it seems like people had easier time restoring one uh, the older older uh, Monkey Island games. But this yeah, one which people might struggle with. Yeah, it it they were a lot simpler as well because well they were 2D instead of 3D. No, we need to do a bit here still. Um, a bit of a summary of the story. Uh, in, this, in this game, basically, Guybrush and Elaine, the two main characters, have come back from their honeymoon after having gotten married in the previous game, uh, which we streamed previously. We basically started with the first and then worked our way to here. And once we're done with this game, eventually, we'll be moving on to the Tales of Monkey Island games. Uh, and, well, after that, hopefully return to Monkey Island as well. That was a surprise to see that announced in the middle of us streaming this game, or this series. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and at the moment, Guybrush is island-bound because he's a suspect in a bank robbery whilst he was locked into the freaking vault and someone else with a mask of his face robbed the place. <laughs> now... Uh, that talks a priest. I'm happy to see someone uh, playing Escape. Usually many don't play this one. I, yeah, I, I'd heard that this one has a bad reputation. And I did have thoughts of possibly skipping it. Uh, also in these... Well, at, when we started with this game and its uh, problems became a bit obvious. Uh, but a video of pu pushing up roses... This, yeah. And decided helping me decide to give it a shot anyways and it's just being broken as all hell has been half the fun of it so far <laughs> yeah uh let's I see we don't need to wait 10 minutes for finish an animation yeah it has had some issues with that now uh, i do have a hint book I, I call it i keep calling it a hint book because gog calls it a, a hint book but it's actually just more of a walkthrough uh, I have that on the side here in case I got stuck because, well, I, I would have gotten stuck for hours so far, especially with the freaking manhole puzzle. If you can even call that a puzzle. Uh, let's see. We need to pick up an artificial hand here, but for that we need to go into our Tomb Raider inventory. And... yep. Use this one. What? Let's see. We were supposed to use this near him, or do we use him? Okay. There we go. Do you mind if I turn this on? I said, do you mind if I turn this on? Okay, so that that's it, it's it's deafening his senses for the moment. It's a basket of finely crafted prosthetic and in, limbs. Whilst he can't hear us. It's a basket of finely crafted prosthetic limbs. We steal the wooden hand. Nope, just the haunting melodies of my music box. <laughs> oh uh, bloody heck. Nope, music stopped. Let's see. Toxic Priest again. Fun fact, this game's graphics are like this due to it being pushed hard to play on the PlayStation 2. Okay. Yeah, but uh, PlayStation 2 game is rather good looking. Like, I heard people hate the graphics, but it's, the graphics are not too bad, with some exceptions. That's in some areas it has been very rough. Yeah, it, the animations are still nice uh, so far, mostly. If, if, even as Guybrush phases through the, the wall. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So we have evidence that Peg Nose Pete, the robber without a nose, uh, was at the site of the, of the robbery. We still need to find the loot and to prove that he actually did it. Um, let's see. Okay, apparently we need to go to the bait shop and use the, use the perfume. Uh, let's see. Let's move away from that before that gets annoying. Let's see. pick up wood shavings left by Ozzy's cane. Combine the shavings with the spritzer. Okay, what's that what? for? 
and then okay that's not doing what it, I wanted to uh, let's see you okay that that's it use nothing smells better than cedar cologne okay but it, it's empty <laughs> <laughs> I've tried to make perfume, or at least an adjacent to perfume, so at well, at least once, I think. And you need actual water and such to get the scent out of it into the fluid. You made perfume. Now, I tried to, and that was like ages ago. I was a yeah, dumb kid, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just never make them near me. I hate perfumes. Yeah. People say this smells nice. Miss I just, all I say, feel is stinging in my nose. In annoyance yeah, I when totally I totally agree with that them. as well. The back, eh? Can't resist the smell of fresh bait, huh? If that's fresh, yeah. I want to know what old bait smells like. <laughs> oh, and he's so offended he instantly turns around. Okay, so for some reason it says to use this perfume adjacent with the free bait. Okay. Oh no. And we... Only one per customer. And one per... Handkerchief, flower, bait. Um, okay, how do we get rid of this then? But it sounded. I would we may have mix some bait juice into the bottle. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Da -da 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 -da. Wood shavings, spritzer. Use homemade perfume with free bait. Pick up free bait. Use the free bait in the scupperware, and use artificial hand with the termites. Okay. Yeah, Wait, this what? is definitely getting into some. <laughs> I forgot they react to you pulling out your freaking inventory. Um, Scaring you, bae? Scare? This man is a lunatic. Um, it's a little dead fish used for fishing bait. Do we use this? There. Now my bait will stay fresh. Uh, yay? I don't think it's fresh to begin with. It's a large stinky vat of free bait, marinating in bait juice. Let's try this again then. Uh, see if he uh, see if he tells us off again. Got some of that. Okay, it's already perfumed. So we can put that away. It's a large stinky vat of free bait, marinating okay. juice. Okay, now he doesn't mind. Um, I hope we didn't break me. something with this. It's a little what kind of fish. alchemy are you doing here? Hmm? What kind of alchemy is this? Yeah, it's moon logic. <laughs> yeah, it's moon logic alchemy, that's what. Okay, um... Mm -hmm. Perfume the bait, put the bait in the scupperware. Can we even stick this one in there now? Hmm. I can't fit any more bait in there. Okay. Uh, then let's pick this out and present it to the termites. Hmm, this requires stealth. Okay. Come and get it, boys. And uh, now we've stolen his freaking termites. Where did those go? They must be real hungry for the taste of redwood. <laughs> it's just not as much fun without the termites. <laughs> um. Okay. So what? The, what are we going to need all of this for? <laughs> that is still the freaking question. Uh. Back to the lawyer's office, apparently. I don't hmm. tell me you're gonna trick them to think it's Zeus drumming. 
uh, I don't think that even the lawyers would want that. <laughs> and for those unfamiliar with that word, it's fermented, uh, fermented fish, right? Fermented herring. So yes. Yeah. And you do not want to smell that. You, <laughs> if you do, you'd end up like Peg Nose Pete because you'd uh, can, you'd cut your own nose off <laughs> to get rid of the smell. Yeah, you're supposed to open the can under running water. It has to reduce the stench. Yeah. At least it's a tradition that is quickly dying out and only live on. Most of rare people that like it, very rare, or people that really want to screw with tourists. <laughs> or just to play an old masochist. <laughs> yeah. Okay, it says to go to Ozzy's house again. Uh, um, pick the flower. Put the flower oh, in the perfume. Oop. I think of Ozzy Osborne for some reason. <laughs> there, that should make my concoction smell better. Okay. Uh, yeah, I, I'm completely out of ideas of what the where the hell the game wants me to go, which is why I'm using the hints through. So, <laughs> yeah, I have no idea how to freaking find yeah, <clears throat> Peg nose. So let's see. Use the cologne with the platypus at Ozzy's feet. The heck. Okay. Get out of the conversation with him as quickly as possible. Poor thing. Poor endangered giant wombat. How would it you know a what wombat. a How would you know what a wombat is, Kypros? You've never heard of Australia. I'd hate to see the creature that laid this. Anything else to look at? No. Poor thing. Poor dim witted giant koala. <laughs> What? Poor thing. Really? Poor dim witted giant koala. Poor thing. Uh, Poor dim witted giant koala. Uh, baby koala. No, did did he kill a mother and father? The mo mother and son or child? Bleh. I'm just failing with my words all over the place, huh? <laughs> Poor thing. Poor ferocious man-eating giant <laughs> crocodile. Yeah. Uh, they get bigger. Cabros, they get bigger in Australia than that. Ozzy kills wild animals. <laughs> okay. Yeah, but he does use the guns too, but let's not get into that the whole debate. Uh, what Poor is thing. that? Poor cuddly wuddly giant dingo. Dingo? C cuddly wuddly dingo, you know. <laughs> those things will tear you a freaking part if they can. And that's not the how is that a dingo? <laughs> it, it, it looks like a deer. Poor thing. Poor doomed hapless giant kangaroo. Is he just plucking random words together or something? I feel like it, but they got bigger than that. Poor thing. Poor cuddly wuddly giant dingo. <laughs> okay. That's actually... There's look. something creepy about that guy. Okay, I was... <laughs> I was certain he'd have a snapback to us like some of the other characters. Poor thing. Poor defenseless giant platypus. Yeah, yeah platypuses aren't platypus. that defenseless. Yeah, no, don't... Don't let them sting you with their thumbs. Yeah, they... They actually have poison <laughs> stingers there. Yeah, it will make... Someone survived it. But get this, the Armstrong and it swelled up huge. Like, the bump was bigger than the thigh. Okay. That's it's a... swollen over all, almost all the entire arm. Ah, that explains more. So, yeah. Basically, it was what that bump, the bump was on this area that it stung, so. Yeah, like he, he, the wrist, I think the wrist was fine, just the upper arm was extremely swollen. <laughs> it just looked like... Uh, I think you can find the pictures online about it. 
is not nice. Yeah. Um, I, I, I'm a bit late with this, but uh, how would your stream go, Kara Jitsu? <laughs> and how are you all doing? Uh, yeah, <laughs> you could say I was a bit surprised by getting graded in the first place. <laughs> and the freaking alert for that not working. Um, actually, let me take a look at it. That should be active. It should be active among the alerts. Um, stream elements or no stream labs. Uh, let's see, alert box. Let's do a test rate. Okay, hi. But why did it not work earlier then? That just well, it, <laughs> for the people who would want to see the animation at least, there you go. Uh, yeah, I'm blaming that on a bot not working properly. I'm guessing. Huh. Oh well, back to this, and why the hell are we spritzing a freaking dead platypus with perfume? Nah, oh no. To myself and a select group of close friends. That he doesn't even want to use it, the one, let's see. Uh, use cologne with the platypus at Ozzy's feet. But seriously, why? Are we supposed to make him smell like this? I don't think he'd like that. I, hmm. I pray we're not trying to extract the poison. Oh, oh wait, it should be called Venom. Mm. Why are you trying to buy the Caribbean? I thought I made it clear. The Caribbean is infected by the disease known as piracy. I intend to cure it with some old-fashioned Australian capitalism. I'm tired of discussing your warped dreams. And I'm tired of discussing them. <laughs> and again, he, well, I'll be seeing you later. Not too soon, I hope. Again, he sort of indirectly admits. <laughs> it's nailed down. Indirectly, he admits that his uh, warp, his dreams are warped. But let's give this another try for whatever reason. Yep. Okay, you're interested in it for some reason, Ozzy. As I could see you moving your head along. I prefer to keep this to myself and a select group of close friends. Pick the flower, combine with it. Use cologne. Wait, not cologne. Not a perfume, the cologne. Did we have any cologne? Or is it... Where is this supposed to be? Okay, maybe I missed some step in this. And let me take a bit of a look up. Let's see. Sword, sponges, handkerchief. Pick up spritzer, pick up spritzer on the ground, and, and the cologne displayed on the left side of the counter. Okay, so we did, that's something completely different. I was just being a dumbass. Okay, well, time to rush out then, and yeah, go pick life. it up. <laughs> Running all the way back. Oh. Getting stuck I on think, something again. I think I know what the egg is. Yeah. <laughs> Ostrich. No. Hmm? Bigger. Amoa. Oh, those things, yeah. It, it's not Australian, but it's New Zealand is quite close. Okay. Uh, where is this? Yeah, come on, guy, brush this. Let's see. Perfume stand cologne. I think Mo was still alive around this time. There we He actually lets us pick hey, it up. That. Okay. <laughs> well, I guess he's sensible enough to not annoy the uh, suspected bank robber. <laughs> okay. That, I expected we'd have to go through a bunch of hoops for that. Okay, right back to here. Still no freaking idea why we even want to make his platypus smell good. Yeah, wait, you could me, probably get a me. euphemism out of that. Oh, no, 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 <laughs> no, not gonna ask about it, no, no. And yeah, th this is half of the humor of these streams, uh, me annoying Drakir, the, my co-commentator over there, with annoying puns and stuff. No, no, he tried to kill me with them. What are you doing? Hmm. 
And what is that horrid smell? You befouled my platypus. <laughs> There's another euphemism for you, probably. Oh, crikey, look what you made me do. Now I need to order a new cane. Oh, and now he's gone. And now we probably get new sawdust. I don't think we're going to need sawdust, but yeah. we can probably just go through his stuff now. Yeah, okay. Definitely. Have we clicked the egg? Uh, we have looked at it. No, I have no interest in trying to hatch the egg. I'd hate to see the creature that laid this. <laughs> it's a giant bird that was vegetarian, probably. The only, only thing you could think, think of the egg is an animal oh. that was already extinct, Megalania. So I pray it's not that egg. <laughs> ostrich? The, the, ostrich. Poor thing. Poor, ferocious, man-eating giant ostrich. Yeah. <laughs> He's yeah, called an emu. Stuffed relics behind this door. Dude, it looks like an ostrich actually there. But it's locked. I will not put it past the developers if they got animals mixed up. Yeah, this was released in the the 90s or the zero, close to the zeros, I think. Probably closer hmm. to the zeros, though. Mixing up a dingo with what looks like a deer is pretty bad. Okay, is there anywhere we can loot here? Because we're going to need a key. Uh, he does seems, doesn't seem to be interested in his chest. Let's see. Britzer, lawyer's office. Let's see. House of Sticks, Ozzy's King, Bait Shop, Free Bait. Oh, I missed a bit here, it seems. Go to Swamp and use hose main perfume with Puddle. Okay. What? Then. Okay, apparently we're not supposed to do anything in here because it says to go out and back to town. Okay, then we, we can go to the swamp and, well, add to our abomination of a perfume over there. <laughs> oh, hello. Still here, are ya? Nope, not anymore. Okay. I presume they made... yep, my puddle. So... Oop. And it's taking a moment to load in again. Um... Yeah, I hope we won't... <laughs> I won't... We, I hope we won't end up boring people too much with this. It's just... yeah, the game has a bit of issues running on modern systems. Yeah. Oh, uh, don't forget to save. Yeah. As he gets stuck on loading again for a moment. Hmm. But yeah, I'm going to have to agree with one thing here, and that is that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> in the previous games, most of the puzzles. In most of the previous games, a lot of the. Uh, puzzles did make some sense on some level, like we figured out a good amount of them on our own. But here, yeah, I... It's just random actions leading to random things, almost. Yeah, for... Again, the other games, as you said, uh, it made sense, and also you got, in a way, some hints about it. Yeah, that made it a bit easier as well, instead of having it completely told to you here. But I get the feeling that even with hints, uh, people likely wouldn't have been able to figure this out uh, as easily. So, let's see then. Uh, Maybe then. that's what it's called. Uh, we have a walkthrough instead of a hint book here. Uh, they just couldn't make into the hints instead of that. No, we just have. We just make a walkthrough instead. Yeah. It wouldn't make sense anyway. And it says that we have to go to. Actually, we. Okay, we probably missed our opportunity with this or something because it said to... Let's 
So leave Ozzy's house back to town. That sound is going to get annoying, so I'm putting it away. Uh, go to House of Sticks. Use a termite-infested hand with Ozzy's new cane, which is located near the stick design. Or the stick sign. Oh. Good. So basically to sabotage his cane, even though we'd already made him break one? Like, what is the use of that for us? Well, there it is. I don't think so, because he, he returned to his house already. It is, it is over there. You're walking towards it right now. Ah, there. This cane don't has an mean... almost imperceptible crack in it. Looks like high quality wood, though. Okay. What tarnation are you doing, son? Um, just looking at my stuff. That's what they call it these days. Now, be quick about it. I wouldn't want any women folks to see that. <laughs> Come on. Hey. I beg your pardon, good sir. Okay. <laughs> Those little buggers sure know high quality wood when they see it. Pretty. My new kind of better be ready. Oh, sure is, Mr. Mandrup. It's right uh, over on that bench. Creepwood? Thinking of buying a walking stick of your own, are you? Uh, might make you look more distinguished. <laughs> Quite like a monkey in a hat. <laughs> yeah, those are funny. Hey. <laughs> Ready? Put it on my bill, Freddy, and don't even think about overcharging me, or I'll own ya. Yes, sir. Always a pleasure, Mr. Mandrill. Oh, now, oh, he's leaving a trail of sawdust. Okay. That does make sense, but... Yeah, how we got it there... Hmm, that is a bit less, so it... Okay. Um. Hmm. Let's yes, what the second. heck? Now it says to go to the house of prosthesis and spray the uh, spray the owner with the homemade perfume. Okay. Again, how we? I'm guessing they. I'm guessing they somewhat uh, expected people to just ra use random items on every character in the game. Not a good design. And also, wait, is this perfume supposed to clean his clogged nose or make it worse? We'll see in a few moments. I uh, will prepare the funeral. Uh, funeral? Funeral <laughs> casket. Whew, that's an all too familiar smell. Guess I can't complain though, since Zexophilia J. Hangtime is my best customer. Zexophilia J. Hangtime. The man regularly buys prosthetic noses from me. Really? He's my, uh, really good friend. Yeah. I lost track of him and, uh, missed him so much that I made a little odor potion to remind me of him. Okay, too much information. I have a strict rule of don't ask, don't smell. Well, anyways, if you know where I can find my uh, friend, that'd be very helpful. Oh, yeah, sure. He lives out past the mists of time marsh. You can't get through there, though, without the directions he gave me. And it's boiled away someplace in my phylomatic system. Well, let's go get that file. I can't. Pongo, my filing monkey, ran away a while back. He was the only one who knew how to run the phylomatic. As a result, I have no idea how to retrieve the map. But if you can figure it out, feel free. The controls are right here. Okay, I was I was already grabbing for a pen, but really, so that whole thing was to make a post uh, to make a perfume that stank like peg nose peat. Uh, again, how the hell we were supposed to figure that out? But it makes sense now. But probably is just we didn't get really a hint about it. Like we know he he knew people by smell. Yes. But we didn't get hint of how he smelled it to begin with. Uh, let's see. Write down the name he tells you. Twiddle with the filing system control. Uh, let's see. It was XJ something. Uh, we're going to need to spritz him again, aren't we? Ah, forget it. Okay. Sorry, but I want to be sure of this. Who did you say this smell belonged to? The 
like I told you, it belongs to Zexophilia J. Hangtime. Thanks. There we go. XJH. Okay, put that away. That's an. I've never heard anyone name that. Now, according to the hint, the five faces the represent you know, letters so up to four at a time. Uh, so th this first face is A to D, the second would be A to H, and the third I to M, uh, fourth N to S, and the, re the last would be T to Z. Or is that... Yeah, that's four letter. Okay, so we need... Um, nope. No, no. Get to, to the first one. For X, we'll need the fifth face. So, two. Come on, three. Four and five. For next, we'll need the third. So, two, three, and with this one, it's just the second one. Okay, again, the only way we could have found that out was by complete trial and error. If this works, yeah, that, that is. That's not a good game design. It is not a point and clicking game. See? There are directions to Pegno's Beats House. Weird. Yeah. It looks more like a train schedule to me. Okay. Uh, that me prosthetic proboscis model TK421. Mr. Time Mart's 210 East. Okay. Yeah, it does look like. Okay, I'm guessing that's the directions we need to go take. East, east. east. Yep, constantly east and then south. Okay. You may want to write them down for convenience. Uh, let's look at them again then. Weird. Looks more like a train schedule to me. Does it want to uh, Does it have anything to do with the time? Okay, times are different. They're, it gives an example in the walkthrough, and the times on that are different than here. So yeah, I'm going to note these down. Yeah, and also people, we already noticed that Mist O Time Marshes is a pun. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, 1255 East, 105 East. This probably has something to do with that clock that we saw on the gate. I then... can't get behind his first name. Yeah, it, it's a fake name. I think. Uh, uh, I, I hope so. For... It sounds more like a condition or something. And again, peg no speed. That that would probably be more the alias. So, <laughs> Cisophilia. That's that is a name. I'll admit. Cisophilia. <laughs> Philia is something else, Hirian. Okay. Let's put those away. Uh, I mean, I, I won't be. They are not about making kinky yokes here. Okay, and oh out. Dear. Oh dear. Ah, okay. Remember those, you know, remember the chess players? Yes. Yeah, they have a clock and, well, we have need of time. Oh no. Yeah, we're going to steal that clock. Okay, and... Wait, I thought you could exit through there. Or is it here? Okay, odd. I'm pretty sure we could go from the lower area to the upper area. But apparently not reverse. I don't think we tried to go through there. Oh well, we'll see. There we go. Now we need to both we need to get both of them to look away. Um yes. 
So Castaneda really has a thing for the bank teller, huh? Oh, yes. He carries a picture of Brittany with him wherever he goes. And five. Okay, now it's... Yeah, it, it's assuming we are talking with them for the first time, so it has a, a, a dialogue path that doesn't really work anymore. Um... Hmm. I'm looking for a no-nosed pirate. Yes. Does he play chess? Uh, I don't think so. Then I don't care. Who's winning now? It's too close to call. Can I play next? Sure, if you don't mind waiting a few hours. Oh, why so long? It's all his fault. See that look of concentration on his face? He's trying to divine the outcome of every possible move through sheer force of will. It's a very time-consuming process. And one that is not made any faster by your never-ending babbling. Well, pardon me for being able to hold two thoughts in my head at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> for some reason, the right one sounds somewhat familiar to me. <laughs> Oh, sound familiar to me. I'll let you get back to your game. Thank you. Um, yes. Hi, Brittany. <gasps> Brittany, where? <laughs> Ooh, good move. Don't tell me you're gonna count that. You bet your bonny butt I am. You unbelievable jerk. Who was it told me that rules are rules, Tabo? Fine. You wanna see a move? Here's a move! And it's loading. I I is he going to is he going for his throat? Uh I think he's supposed to be going for his throat. <laughs> the game is loading it in too slowly. Come on. Of course, we heard the loud sound of a clicking clock. Yeah, it's not exactly loud, but it is uh, a tad annoying over time. Like I, I know that some people. That move? This is a move. You Oop. can't do that. Oh yeah, who's gonna stop me? Gainsy and pig. Fringe candidate. Wink. <laughs> Full step standing. Doily sniffer. <laughs> Cheese chomper. Monkey molester. Okay, what? that's. I'd say that's our cue to <laughs> leave. <laughs> okay, yeah. Now we can use. <clears throat> now we can use that clock to go. Yep, divers. Why? Why are you running? <laughs> why are you circling around here? the heck? Yeah, no, what? they were just shouting insults at each other there, <laughs> trying to disguise them. Yeah, I said earlier this game is not about to make some kinky jokes, but... Oh. Monkey molester? I was not expecting. That's <laughs> beyond kink. That's not... No, that's not even kink. That's horrible. Yeah. Oh. <clears throat> so, yeah, now we have... Well, we, we now have an... <clears throat> A compass added in, and again, Guy Rush is going to practice his marching in place. Before that, if people wonder what he has on his leg, that's to prevent him from escaping from the island. It's it basically uh, a GPS tracker that if he goes off the island, is probably going to kill him. Yeah. Just, it's a voodoo version of that. And I think both those things are snakes. And, oh, okay, yes, yes, now I, I see it. Save again. Oh, oh, did you save? I just saved. Oh, alright, I missed that. Okay. Apparently, uh, whenever we, mo we move a screen in this area, time is going to change. So we're going to have to follow the directions. Uh, until, well, if the time changes again. But since everything is east, we're just going to head for a straight line east all the time. <laughs> Except for the oh. last. 
Yeah. So Guybrush is just going to run in, is go just going to wrap himself in a straight line for hours. <laughs> I, I just hope that each is. Each uh, step will not take forever. Last time we tried this, it worked. Let's see if it works again. Yeah, for, for some reason, when we load in, he gets on it. Yeah, it doesn't always work, but works. Most of the time. Okay. It's weird. Um. Oh dear. Let's see. Use the raft, then use the clock. And it's trying to load in on the. There we go. See? Is that going to give us a clock in the corner or something? Oh, or just put it down instead. Okay. Um. Hmm. Time is off. Maybe we need to... Let's see. Time will change when you enter a new room in the swamp. Continue print directions until you get to the gates. Kybras will give you a, a key? What? Hmm. Okay, I guess we just have to... go around. If... Okay, I was expecting him to actually turn, not to <laughs> spin That's in west. circles. That's west! <laughs> there we go. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sorry, people. He did a... He has a bit trouble with navigation. <laughs> uh, let's see, that is three... Five past three. Yep, yep, got the time. Okay, I guess you could count <laughs> this as the, as a hint. Like, do you have the time? Uh, ten past twelve. Okay, east. It, and now it's going to... Hey, Guybrush, I need your help. Yep, oh, that, that's... What? Right. Who are you? I'm Guybrush Threepwood. Now do yourself a favor and open the gate. Oh, you'll need this too. Um. Um. Great. A rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. And this. <laughs> that thing again? Hey, hey great what? gun! Watch out, peg nose. If you're really me. Then what number am I thinking of right now? Twelve. Creepy. That is the number I'm thinking of. I guess you really are me. Okay. It's uh, locked. Did we just accidentally skip all of this? And yeah, this thing again from the first freaking game. Uh, this really skeleton key. Okay, and you are going to take off. Uh, Thanks, Guybrush. You're the greatest. So oh, I've got one more thing for you. Ooh, a rope. That'll be useful. Uh, Is it a rope? rope? Yeah, he just nopes out. <laughs> okay. Great. It said to ask him who he was. To write that down. He's... No, oh. I see what's going on. Yeah, we're going to have a bit of time travel and shenanigans here. As in, we're going to be him in a bit. Oh, oh no. Mm -hmm. Unlock the gates. One more object. Continue following the directions. Okay, it is now uh, thirteen thirty on that. Uh, One thirty. Okay, so we go east. One o five. 
east. Um, three, three twenty. No, three forty east. Okay. Hey, Guybrush, I need your help. Wait, are we on the? No, don't say anything. You'll cause a paradox. Thanks. Um, me? I'll try to be careful. Uh. Okay. Uh. 420 south. Uh, wait, but we can't go through the gates. Ah, uh, okay. Don't leave. You'll cause a paradox or something. Oh, nuts. Uh oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Uh, we were supposed to. We. Wait, we were supposed to hand the stuff over. Why, why would we even? <laughs> okay. Well done, Helia. Well done. <laughs> uh, I thought, I thought it was like a, a gag, like you're not supposed to be here yet or something. Uh, is it going to do anything beyond this, or is it, do we need to load now? Behold, my captain. <laughs> Okay, I, re I really want to see if it gives a game over screen or something, but I don't want to wait too long on this. So... Shall we just load? Probably. Okay, we'll have to go through that again, though. Yeah, do... Do try to remember to save. Yeah. And to not cause a time paradox. <clears throat> okay, need to load into the inventory again. Yeah, we're going to save once we uh, have that thing put down. Actually, it's probably better to put down the save once we meet the uh, future brush. Yeah. Okay, put it down. All right. Okay, then remember this time, east, not west. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes I, sometimes I'm stupid enough to confuse, uh, right? Uh, guy brush. <laughs> sometimes I'm e even dumb enough to confuse left and right. But you did once confuse north and south for some reason. Hey, Guybrush, I need your help. Here, take this. Who are you? Who do you think I am? Open the gate for yourself, okay? Oh, you'll need this too. Um, great, a rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. And this. Hey, great, a gun! Watch out, Peg Nose. Where the hell did you get that from? If you're really me, then what number am I thinking of right now? 69. Creepy. That is the number I'm thinking of. I guess you really are. Uh, oh. <laughs> no! I'd better not. I think all this talking to myself is wreaking havoc with the space time continuum. Why? <laughs> Why that cursed number? <laughs> uh, that does. Yeah. I've never had a gun in any of my previous adventures. This should be fun. I haven't seen one of these in a long time. It seems heavier than I remember it, though. Yeah, because it's three dimensional now. I bet I could open any lock with this key. Oh, come on. A literal skeleton key. Okay. There we go. Then we pedal aside. The greatest. And then future brush. Oh, I've got one more thing for you. Ooh, a rope. That'll be useful. Okay, something almost fell over. Uh, 
All right. Now we go in. Don't forget to save. Yep. Oh, come on. <laughs> Okay. For some reason, it really likes to hang on that screen for a bit, quite a bit. Okay. So we're about halfway through the stream. So, again, he gets stuck on something for a bit there. Hey, Guybrush, I need your help. No yeah, no. Say anything. You'll cause a paradox. Thanks. Um, me? I'll try to be careful. Okay, now we need to give this stuff back. Uh... Here, take this. Who are you? I'm Guybrush Threepwood. Now do yourself a favor and open the gate. That's not how it goes. Don't you remember what you said when you were where I am now? Uh-oh. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we have to actually keep note of what he said specifically. <laughs> Okay. Oh dear. Well, we have plenty of opportunities to try it again. <laughs> Seeing as we seem to be stuck in a time loop of sorts. Ah. Uh, ha. Ha. Hey, Guybrush. I need your help. Tom wants to get in bonked later. And wait, he said 69. Uh, we're gonna need to remember that, don't we? Yeah, the, the other line. Okay, just give him that. Here, take this. Who are you? Ah, there. Who do you think I am? Open the gate for yourself, okay? Okay, then we hand him the our chicken. chicken with a pulley in the middle and then the gun then he's going to open it up and or this. Yeah. hey great a gun watch out peg nose if you're really me then what number am i thinking of right now this the nine <laughs> 69 creepy that is the number i'm thinking of i guess you really are me the way he says it bloody heck <laughs> You're the greatest. Okay. Then we. Oh, I've got one more thing for you. Ooh, a rope. That'll be useful. Wait, if we're if we go south, then we are leaving. Where is this going to put us at an island or something? Um. Let's see. Uh, 1255 East. Okay. I have to say this is a this is a bit more interesting than the usual mazes where you just have to follow the directions. Yep. So the mm. the whole time paradox thing wasn't really needed with this, but oh well. Nope. Oh. Someone's in there. White and blue. All right. I just realized something. We never got to know what the heck the free sharks were in the last game. <laughs> yeah, I think it was just a, a background thing, like with how much you could see in the background of the other places wherever you were. Okay. Then we load, and that does not fit his position, fix his positioning. Okay, so the game is just needing a moment to load again. Yeah. <laughs> Interesting music. <laughs> Thank you. 
Hmm. Nice little drink. Ain't that one of the crab cages? If it is, it's a bit long. Do I th think I can see something moving in it or behind it? Something purple that's spinning or something? I, the heck is I don't that? know if that is purple or it's just water or what is going on. If I see something moving there as well. It looks like it's spinning. Guybrush, are you going to get off this thing or not? It's going to be the window and the trampoline on over again with this, isn't it? Hmm. Maybe? I don't know. So, yeah, nothing we can do except for wait to, for Guybrush to uh, gather up the courage to get on the freaking dock. Yeah, I... Still, I would not be surprised if we abandoned this game simply due to... It just takes so long to load. Okay, move the, the walkthrough up a bit to match up with where we are. Hmm. Come on, Guybrush. Going to do this again, just in case. And see if doing this again maybe dislodges him, because I have no idea what is causing this stuff. Hmm. Okay. Nope, still stuck. Are you sure? I, have you really tried to walk up? Yeah, I'm, I'm pressing the controls. Let's use... Actually, let me do a Google. Let's see. Escape from Monkey Island. Uh, raft. Game breaking bug. Raft freezes on Pegnos Pete's house. Uh, let's see. Um, Guybrush let go of the paddle, then immediately picks it up and freezes. Music is going on the back one, but I can't do anything at this point. I can move Guybrush to the... Pause the game. Okay. Known bug. Didn't release the patched version. The game... This game... Well, this bug starts the second you start a new game. Or doesn't, mostly don't. So there's no way to know you have it until you reach the point where it comes into effect. The only thing you can do at that point is start completely over. Or say, fuck it, and get a refund if you're under two hours played. Um... Well, that's a bit of a dilemma. Um, uh, okay, I can see now why there's many people that dislike this game then. If it's one of the rare ones that actually have severe bugs. It's nothing to do with Steam or GOG version. Okay, there's a tutorial here for crash fixes. Download ME Launcher, we are using that. But it, this is not a crash though. Mm -hmm. Delete original monkey for that exe. Rename patched. Hmm. Okay, let's let's try and doctor this through a bit quick then. Uh, quit, yes. And then um, let's see. Change, exit launcher. Update game. File not found. Okay. Um, hmm. Change resolution. Creates patched. Monkey. Hmm. Let's see, um, games, then Escape from Monkey Island. I, ah, there it is. Patched Monkey, that, uh, Monkey more, that Monkey 4.exe. Delete the old, and then rename the patched version 
to monkey4exe. Okay. Then close that off. Start it up again. Wait, Pat. It was running through the patch thing? Uh, hmm. Wait, That's... did you get a patch to make it work to begin with? Don't tell me it just completely broke or something. Let's see. Change that. Don't have... Actually, no, I don't... Hmm. Did I have it in a different... Okay, it's starting up now, and it goes into this thing. Uh, does it allow... Uh... Okay, I have game again, but it did something stupid now that it's running in not windowed, and it's very obviously noticeable on the stream that something is not up, correct? And I can't even... S uh... It's uh, where now it. <sighs> okay, Control Alt Delete, Task Manager. Okay, and <sighs> now I can't even see the freaking there. End task. There we go. Hmm. Okay, so if I go back to this and rename this back to patched monkey4exe, close that off again, start it up again. Okay. Hmm. Okay, I think the game might have just broken itself. Hmm. And yeah, that is how it was. <laughs> Something that was noticeable in the stream there is that uh, of how I put up the sidebars for this game. I just put up the back, the cover art on its back twice and put a black box over that. Uh, well, hide that. Um. Yeah. What do we do now, though, if the game is not going to want to play ball? Any, I'm still going to try. Just, hmm. Is the next game installed already? Not yet. If I restore the old here, okay, it will start up again, and it goes back into this. Uh. Hmm. Options, update, English. Hmm. Okay, yeah. It, hmm. It, this might be the first case then where we actually have to abandon the game because, uh, yeah, <laughs> redoing so this know. is going to need a lot of uh, tinkering around to get it working again. And it even then, it might just. Before. Mm -hmm. We had one game that had crash issues or being broken before at the very end. Uh, uh, yeah, hydrophobia. game. Yeah. Listen, I'm, I'm not going to go there too much, but that really flipped Hillian off. Yeah. Hmm. It, it's a shame that. Like, we can get the game to work reasonably. Uh, but then I can't screen share it to Drakir, so he can't give live commentary on it. So... Yeah. Hmm. It says, if I was to watch it on Twitch, everything he do would be a few seconds behind. So it, it's not oh. really live commentary, huh? I got it working again. I, I forgot to... I forgot to hit the ch ch change resolution button. Oh, uh, so we can continue streaming then. Uh, Guybrush is still going to be stuck here then, though. So what if we if we load back to here? Um. 
Yeah, let, let's do this bit again and hope that somehow the bug gets dislodged. I need your help. Yeah, uh, uh, screen share, please. Yeah, I'm moving around first. Uh, and you've already seen this anyways. Uh, ta -ta -ta, screen share. Escape from Monkey Island. Uh, yeah, if, if it'll still get stuck, the yeah, the only option then would be for me to uh, replay everything off screen. I mean, that may not work. No, don't say anything. You'll cause a paradox. Thanks. Um, me? I'll try to be careful. Uh, no, not that button. Yeah, now I'm, now I'm just getting annoyed. Give him the key. Here, take this. Who are you? Who do you think I am? Open the gate for yourself, okay? And then we... Uh, there, the chicken. Oh, you'll need this too. Um, <laughs> great, a rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. And then the gun. And this. Hey, great, a gun! Watch out, peg nose. If you're really me, then what number am I thinking of right now? 69. Creepy. That is the number I'm thinking of. I guess you really are me. The way he says 69, <laughs> seriously. Thanks, Guybrush. You're the greatest. Okay. Uh, yeah. Oh, I've got one more thing for you. Ooh, a rope. That'll be useful. Yeah, okay. speak this pot is done. Save again. Yeah. It seems that. Uh, hmm. It seems okay. The, the game, here. the game forced my resolution to change before, earlier, and why is it not? I. Uh, he's not. Nothing's responding. Okay, there we go. Uh, resume game. Get out of this. Safe, timey wimey. Okay. Um. Yeah, we'll we'll have to see if this bug happens again. I could, I could re try redoing everything up until now, on a new save and see if that might uh, help. Um. But yeah, we'd have to end the stream then, anyways. Hmm. Okay. Okay, he puts it away. And immediately... Okay, yeah, it... It's just plain bugged. Okay, let's see. Is there any other way to fix this? Let's see. I swear, this game has been giving us a lot of headaches already. Mm -hmm. Let me launch it at EXE. I've already used... I'm already using that. And it did say it updated to 1.1. So why is it still doing the crash? And, hmm. Or wait, the bug happens at the start of the game. So wait, no, it, it, it should have been updated to 1.1 before I even started with the game. Um, let's see. Anything to the original disc here. This bug was even on the original disc. Oh, figured out a way to escape the soft lock. What you need is the keyboard for pausing the game, spy, uh, space bar. When you enter the animation of Kyrus on the raft approaching the dock, press and hold the pause button and rapidly pause and unpause the game. Depending on the frame in which you begin rapid pausing, Kyrus will either let go or the paddle or not. A 50% chance of doing it. Okay. Really? And, well, this is the. Yeah, we, we might as well try it for a moment here. Well, sure, if it works, do it works. Otherwise... Yeah, otherwise I... Yeah. Oh, yeah, at dear. least this could sound a lot worse. Though that is probably going to set up... Okay, yeah, I'm going to have to stick up an epilepsy warning or something. And it, it failed. Okay... 
then we give that another actually to have I'm going to shut off the the footage for a moment there to both the tier and the stream because okay yeah now I'm, I'm starting it to feel a headache set in already from that so uh, ex excuse I, me for a moment with this as I try yeah, it I again I don't have epilepsy but I am light sensitive and Flashes don't give me a lipstick of salt, just gives me headaches. Or pain in the eyes. But yeah, if, if this keeps up going, I would just say just skip this game and go straight to the next one for... The next one should be more co cooperative. And still bugged. Okay, third and final try then. If it still goes wrong, then yeah, we'll have to look for another possible solution. Or just give up for now. Yeah, for this is oh, this is one was after all the worst one apparently. And I can see it get be being known as the worst one if it had that severe bug even in the first version on CD and all. For well, that's severe. And yes. seriously, what, what were we expecting to try to remove that bug when releasing it to Gyu Gi and Steam? Okay, according to comments on that uh, thread, on that Steam thread, it does. It has worked for some, so let's give it two more tries. And yeah, hopefully we won't miss some things that are too important for the following game. Though there is one thing that I dreaded. Uh, there, uh, you know, there's been several things now that have been randomized, like the, the number and Pagnos' name. Or alias. There's another thing like that at the end. Like you remember insult sword fighting? That's a failed attempt. Uh, uh, yeah, that would have been something like that, but com with the effects and commands completely randomized. It be uh, it's called monkey combat, and the only way to figure th that shit out would be by complete, yeah, trial and error. Okay. So we basically have uh, more headaches anyway. Yeah. Like, that was one of the reasons to have me apprehensive. Yeah, like, we are listening for a story, but there, there is a limit. Okay. And this thought to sound like a limit. Yeah, final attempt. And if this, if this still remains broken then yeah we might have to move to tales of monkey island next week yeah and there's still rumors after all that this one and the next one is not canon anymore at least that's a rumor to be. okay putting this stick away and fail okay then yeah hmm is chat even updating or anything? Hmm. Like the only thing I can think of next of this would be to go see if there's someone with uh, Monkey Island Escape from Monkey Island save files for after this point or something. Uh, let's see. Escape from Monkey Island. Raft. Anything else here? Yeah, Kuipers won't get off of the raft. Uh, here's my solution. I went back to an earlier save from the first time I navigated the swamp. Then Gavis was listening at the win window. Uh, that This is a different game-breaking bug. Probably not approaching the dock at the right angle. That's not a good thing, it seems. Hmm. Not the correct one, at least. Let's see. That's the number. Chess game scene, no. Um, uh, 
Okay, raft in the swamp. Can't get raft on the... Let's see. This seems to be for a console version or something, but X and triangle stuff. Um, hmm. Let's see. No, wait, is this even the correct escape from Monkey Island? Plus press tactics. Okay, just raft. Use raft with uh, to get the. Uh, Okay, apparently that getting to his raft or something would be the end of the get to his to his shed would lead to the end of the chapter at least. Hmm. Is there really Probably. no fix for this? Again, I can see this being one of those things that made it very hated amongst the fans. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. I'll give this one final try for now. Um, if it fails, I'll end the stream uh, early. But better than having everyone watching it or more listening to me. Yep, yeah, almost having a seizure from all of this flashing. <coughs> yeah, I mean, we will have like 45 minutes left. Yeah. Um, Okay, if this fails, I'll end the stream. I'll give it a few more times after if it still fails. And yeah, if the... Nope, that failed because he... Okay, it's supposed to... The sign that it doesn't fail should be that fa after Guybrush seems to throw away the stick that he'll let go, let's go of it. But no, he keeps grabbing onto it. So... Okay, one final, final, final time... Then I'll end the stream. It is a 50-50 chance, supposedly. And likely to be even less than that. Hmm. But, yeah, I'll try a few more times off-screen. Uh, put down a save if I do manage to get on the, on the dock. If it still fails, despite all of that, that's a fail, then... Yeah, then next week we'll be moving to the Telltale games of Monkey Island. It so, should be working. Yeah, those are a lot more modern, so... Yeah, that is uh, an unexpected and rather unwanted end to the uh, stream tonight. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah, that... I, like I said, I was already not looking forward to that monkey combat stuff. Um, yeah, if there's, if this game refuses to play ball by next week, I'll uh, get yeah, the best I can do is to advise to look up a, uh, <clears throat> a playthrough or a let's play on YouTube for the rest of what is going on. I'll probably do that myself just this, just to see if there are things that are important in the story later on. But, yeah, for now, we'll have to call it there, then. Yeah, sadly enough. Okay. Uh, well, then. Uh, thank you, everyone, who has been watching now or later. Thank you, Karajitsu, for the raid. And thank you, that Toxic Priest and Contagious TV and anyone else who has been chatting. Uh, yeah, sorry, Toxic, that's... Yeah, you have to see me fail to be able to stream to uh, continue with the game. Uh, like I said, I'll try, I'll try a few more times, like ten times or so, to see if I can brute force it past that point. If it you know, that succeeds, then next week we'll be continuing with this game. If not, then next Saturday we will be yeah, moving on to the Tales of Monkey Island uh, game. But for now. Uh, yeah, uh, you were going to say something? Yes, I just said yep. Okay. Tomorrow we'll have Showcase Sunday. We'll be trying out four games for about half an hour each to see if they are any good for streaming later. And then on Tuesdays and Thursdays, we are streaming <clears throat> we are streaming Beyond Good and Evil. So yeah. 
Uh, anything you want to say on the matter? Well, I just hope the tale of uh, the next game will be more smoother. But I also hope that we do get this working. But if it doesn't, this won't work. It, it might be a blessing disguise for all we know. Yeah, I'll, pr I'll probably try one time to start the game over and see if that manages to fix things a bit. For now, uh, let me take a bit of... Oh, oh yeah, the, the chat box needs some fixing. There's, there's names that are moving out into the... Uh, pressing out of the box. Uh, oh, dear. Yeah, I'll do that after I end the stream. So, again, thank you all for watching, and until next time, have a nice day. And until then... Be safe, folks. again, sorry. <laughs> yeah, again, sorry. Yep, until next time. Be safe, folks.